I was looking for a loop function for audio playback and it seems quite easy. Here is a different selection mode like range selection and edit selection. Range selection is recommended for a loop, though selection mode also works. Select a range from the timeline that will be played in a loop. Be careful if you're selecting by dragging inside from the audio timeline. The range icon is for scattered lines and the icon should look like this. If the icon is changed to these triangles then dragging for range selection will destroy the waveform. So start dragging while the correct symbol is shown. Another safe way is to drag from outside the track in the timeline. These look like very basic things but beginners have to know this to edit in DaVinci Resolve. After selecting the range click on the loop icon to make it active. It has become red, so the loop is now active. Let's play to see how the loop sounds. DaVinci Resolve is a good software not only for video editing, but also for audio editing. It uses Fairlight FX plugin. It was not looped and it was playing in the normal fashion. I see no button to play in the loop and the solution is to use a keyboard shortcut to play. Press Alt forward slash or Option forward slash to start the loop playback. DaVinci Resolve is a good software not only for video editing, but also for audio editing. It uses DaVinci Resolve is a good software not only for video editing, but also for audio editing. It uses DaVinci Resolve. It is playing in a loop and this was the way to play in a loop in DaVinci Resolve. Select a range, activate the loop button, and alt forward slash. Thanks for watching and I hope to bring a more detailed video on DaVinci Resolve to you.